Welcome Phoenix fans to the first day of NBL 22 pre-season. We're just going to go around, see how the lads are and how much they're looking forward to another big year. I'm sure they're looking forward to working hard. We'll just uh, head over here to the co-captain, uh, co-captain Kyle. Kyle, just quickly, first day of pre-season. Uh, how much do you love hard work and how much are you looking forward to running around? Um, I love hard work and I'm really looking forward to running around. Is there a player in particular that, that really just kind of loves pre-season, loves getting in front of the coaches? Oh, it's got to be Dane. You know, he's, he's doing everything he can for those extra minutes and, um, you know, each to their own. I think jokes won't get you that far, but um, his hard work will. That lefty hook's looking nice, so I'm interested to see how he goes. And uh, I know the big fella's going to do well. And how much of preseason is actually running around doing weights compared to, to basketball? Um, it's a, lo a lot of it, yeah. A lot of it's prehab stuff. We've already done um, sort of half an hour, 45 minutes of our pre prehab stuff, warming up. and. Um, yeah, there's a good little vibe and mood in the gym this morning. I think everyone's really excited to, to officially get going. Ruben, just quickly, first day of pre-season, we know you're a very hard-working man. Is your, uh, is your mate Isaiah one of the hard-working pre-season men, or what would you say about him? Yeah, he's definitely a hard worker. Um, excited to get back into it. And, yeah. and to year two at the Phoenix, you finished last year in pretty hot form. How excited are you to kind of get back in and hit it with a bit of pace? Yeah, I was excited to get back into it. Um, First day is always the best day, so um, can't wait. Big flying Ryan's just taping up his ankle, which is uh, in pristine condition. First day of pre-season, Ryan, of uh, well, your first actual pre-season with the club, given yeah. you came halfway through. Mm -hmm. How keen are we to uh, do a bit of hard work? Oh, I'm very excited to, to finally get started in the official capacity, and it's been good sort of the previous weeks and, and months just getting in and doing something, but uh, to get the whole team together and, and have uh, more of an organised session, looking forward to. Um, you know, some of the running and stuff, we'll see how we go, but just uh, just excited to get back on the court. And it's your first like proper pre-season a fair while, I think. How important do you think that actually is for yourself, physically and mentally, to get prepared for a year? Yeah, it's going to be huge for me, just uh, just being able to have the base, um, you know, work on parts of the body that, that, that gave me trouble um, throughout last season and, and just make sure I'm ready and strong and um, good to go come round one. So it's going to be very important. I look forward to sort of um, getting stuck into work with the guys and and uh, yeah, building up this this foundation for hopefully a big season. We'll just uh, we'll just grab the coach very quickly. Apologies to stop your conversation there, coach. Sorry, mate, just stretching up. Yeah, out. no, you're yeah. looking very limber. Are you trying to going to join in? Well, yeah, we're not allowed to have any training players in the joint, so um, no, I won't be joining in. <laughs> And day one of pre-season, how hard are we working these guys uh, as we build up? Uh, well, Cam Glidden, given that he's not practicing today, has requested that it just be a running session. So um, I'm, I'm putting the basketballs away and we're just going to get the blokes on the line. And day three of pre-season, you're obviously pretty used to uh, starting pre-season now. How excited are you to get into it and kind of what's it feel like compared to the last, last few years? Oh, obviously, it's a little different with the COVID issues that we've had um, and you know, the numbers that we have at our practice right now. Um, but it's also nice having Xavier into the place uh, for the whole of the preseason, which, you know, as your point guard, he gets a chance to really acclimatise uh, with his teammates, mesh with those guys, and also really start to understand what we're on about from an offensive standpoint. Um, although everything we're doing today is defence. So, but, you know, he'll get, a, he'll get a head start on where the other guys have been previously. So that's a good thing for us. We're just joined by Cameron Glidden here, stretching out the hips. Uh, how's the body? You had surgery a few months ago, pre-season starts today? Yeah, yeah, it's going good. Um, I won't be with the boys for all the stuff today, but um, looking forward to it starting and uh, happy to be back with the lads. How uh, your interview skills line and floor? Is this more comfortable or less comfortable than usual? It's actually more comfortable. I'm looking straight up to the lights, which is a bit uncomfortable, but uh, mm -hmm. you're making it very comfortable. <laughs> you are comfortable in my presence, are you? Very comfortable. And just on pre-season, obviously, Pretty hard working time. Are there any players that kind of like to showboat in front of the coaches, puff the chest out a bit? <laughs> um, no one's showboating because I don't think many people really love this time of year, but um, Kizza and Creaky are usually the front runners and uh, make it look easy. Okay, I've been told Dane's really trying to get himself uh, relevant in front of the coaches again. Is that is that true? Yeah, yeah, that is true actually. He's, um, he's showing all the stuff he's been working on and uh, he's looking great. Just quickly, lads. Simon Wig, he, uh, he's in control of all our, our bodies around here, getting us in peak fitness. How are the boys' conditions heading into pre-season? First time today, I thought it went very well, so it was uh, straight after Breggy, the boys had a good feed and then they happily came in here and got on the ground and started doing some really good exercises to get them ready for training. And that's what we're trying to do, is prevent injury. And so, if they get better doing the little things well, I think we'll be in good shape. X-Men, just quickly. 
Well, here was Xavier Mumford on his first day of uh, pre-season with the Phoenix, his new club. You've been here for a few weeks now, a week or two. How are you feeling? Uh, a bit more acclimatised? Yes, I'm definitely uh, acclimatised, uh, ready to get started with, um, with practice and learning the plays and figuring out each other's games and, and moving forward. How difficult is learning plays? Obviously, this is the first day of really training as a team. How long does it kind of take to, especially as a point guard, kind of warm to the group? I want to say uh, a couple of days. Um, to fill everybody out, see what see um, everybody's strengths and see their weaknesses and see what they can do, see where they like the ball at different type of spots so that they could play to their strengths. And have you met any of the boys you really kind of clicked with yet over your week here? Oh yeah, everybody, I mean I'm clicking with everybody. Um, my, my job as a point guard to be able to have a, a healthy relationship with everybody so that we could succeed. Boys clearly in pretty good spirits as we head into day one of pre-season. Stay tuned to our socials over the next few weeks to see what we're going on day to day, but uh, I'll let the boys go it because training's about to get underway.